guys out there, certainly nicer than it was last night. I'm told it was down here last night, but certainly nicer than last night. So glad you could come out to, to the show tonight. This is a tribute to the man in black, Johnny Cash. Paul Anthony will lead things off here. He's the world's only Johnny Cash tribute artist that is welcome to the legendary Cash Cabin in Nashville, Tennessee, which was Johnny's private recording studio now owned and operated by his son, John Carter Cash. And he recorded the classic Johnny Cash record, The Nashville Connection, with two of Johnny's musicians, drummer W.S. Flew Collin, whose drums I will play tonight, bass player Dave Rowe, along with Kenny Vaughn and Chris Scruggs. It was engineered and co-produced by Grammy winner Chuck Turner. Every effort has been taken to recreate all the famous sounds of Johnny Cash. The guitar playing of Luther Perkins, the stand-up bass of Marshall Grant, and the world-renowned drumming of W.S. Flew Collin. And the vocal sound of the man in black, Johnny Cash, sung by Paul Anthony. Johnny Cash spent his life writing music to tell stories of people in all walks of life, people from both sides of the track. And our mission is to contribute to tell the most authentic Johnny Cash stories with the sounds and accuracy that created the world's musical icon named Johnny Cash.
to go ahead and introduce the band in a little while. This is a great crowd. Is, is there any Johnny Cash fans out there? Put your hand up if you're a Johnny Cash fan. Have you all met my wife? She's over here. It's not June Carter, no. Stephanie Lynn, she's also a national recording artist and she got some great stories to tell. Well, hang on, but boy, before we do the next song, let's wait these folks sit down. He's just having a hard time finding a spot there. No, sit up front, right here. No, it's a better spot. No, right here, I'm not joking with you. All right, you want to sit there, all right. Get what you pay for. <laughs> he wants to hide. Can you hear us all okay up there? How about back there? Back there, you must have paid the big, you got the big tickets. And over here, on the count of three, I want everybody to scream on the count of three, Johnny Cash, as loud as you can. One, two, three. Here's one called Hey Porter, here we go. Hey Porter, won't you tell me the time? How much like Dear Cross and Mason Dixon line? When daylight, would you tell that in the new ring of the bell? And I see the button laying the sleeve is down right up in here. Come on, boys, sing with me now. Hey Porter, hey Porter, what time did you say? How much long till I can see the light of the day? When we hit Dixie, would you tell that engineer to ring the bell? And I see my body laying and sleep is still right up in here. Come on, Luther! Well, this whole train is puffing smoke out right after train my eyes. Well, there's an engineer of the evil blow his whistle, please. I smell frost on the cotton leaves, I feel that some way. Hey, Porter, hey, Porter, please get my bags late. Need nobody to tell me now before I'm Tennessee. Go tell the engineer to make that lonesome whistle scream. We're not so far from home to take it easy on the steam. Come on, Luther! Hey, Porter, hey, Porter, we go open out the door. Well, I'll stop the train, I'll only get off first, cause I can't wait no more. Till the engineer said things a lot, and I didn't know why I'm here for. Gonna set my feet on southern soil, my baby, that southern air. Take us out! These guys are the best in their own right. A good friend of mine passed away, uh, no, not a whole lot, how long, how many years ago, Terry? Ten? Six years ago? This fellow played with, uh, 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 well, he was more his friend than mine, he was way closer than I was with him, Terry Sumption. You must remember Terry Sumption, you know that name out this way. And so Dwayne, he played with Terry, and, and Dwayne's played with just a whole whack of folks, so we're really pleased to have him with us tonight. Uh, this gentleman on my left side, your right side, we'll, we'll tell you who he is in a while. And I'm not sure whether or not you know him back there. But anyway, here's a song that John did. It was uh, on the B side of Hey Porter. Now, do you know what the B side was on a record? So the A side kind of was a hit, and the B side was not the hit. This one ended up being a hit. A little song called, here we go, Cry, Cry, Cry. <laughs> Everybody knows where you go when the sun goes down. 
I think you only live to see the lights of ten. I wasted my time and I would try, try, try. The lights are lost and glow, you're gonna cry, cry, cry. Well, soon your sugar daddies will all be gone. Wake up some cold day and find you alone. You call for me, but I'm gonna tell you bye, bye, bye. Turn around and walk away, you'll cry, cry, cry. Come on, boy, you're gonna cry, 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 and you'll cry alone. But everyone's forgotten and left on your own, you're gonna cry, cry, cry. Face up, loser! You're seven. Are you married? You're not married. I just seen you. I just watched you sing that song with me. Do you like Johnny Cash? I'm going to give you something extra special. You go over right now and see my wife right here at the table. That's just beautiful. You sang that whole song. I watched you do the whole thing. And because you like Johnny Cash, we're going to give you a record. And at the end of the show, all us guys up here, we're going to sign it for you. Is that okay? Now make sure you don't have my wife sign it. We don't want to devalue it. <laughs> For the record, the band is not responsible for anything that this guy says. <laughs> anyway, we're having some fun. Uh, I have to tell you, um, there's a whole lot of folks that that really enjoy this story, and and I have to say that uh, that this this song here became popular once again when that movie came out. I walk the line. So this this song uh, actually came out in 1956, and when John did this story uh, and this song, he did this song when he didn't have a drummer. So because John didn't have a drummer, he tried to make up his own little drum snare sound with the guitar. Now he had to stuff something between the strings and the guitar to get that snare sound. Can you give us a light broom shuffle or something? Like that? So that sound there, John John kind of kind of put together. But but you know I'll show it to you. You know what I need? I need somebody with a twenty dollar American bill. You got one of those? It can't be Canadian, it's got to be an American bill, because there's something in the ink, I'm sure. I think it's 20% in the ink. <laughs> yeah. Does anybody have a, even American dollar bill, does anybody have one of those out there? Just run up real quick. Come on, run up. Michelle, are you married? Yes. That's too bad. You got American money and you're married. I do. One good thing, one bad. Now don't jump over there, just do it slowly. I've seen people, 
I say, what happened here? You've already damaged your shin. What's your name? What is it now? Teresa. What's your favorite Tony Cash song? The right story would be I walk, I walk the line. Now, what are you giving me? You have an American something. You are American. You said dollar. I heard that. Why? Where are you from? Yeah, where's over there? Oh, in Michigan. No, but you have a southern accent. Do I know. <laughs> Mixed up and blonde. That's funny right there. There again, the band is not responsible for anything that this guy says. <laughs> what else you got in there? You have a house key? I I'm short of house keys. <laughs> I'm just kidding with that. So it's Teresa. Folks, put your hands together for Teresa for supplying some of the, some of the band prop tonight. And I just want to let the folks know, in the show tonight up here on stage with me, at least one of us is getting paid today. <laughs> so what John, what John did is he would stick, he would stick this in the, in the guitar strings like that. And I'll show you kind of what he did. Did he try to emulate that? snare sound. Now, Teresa, and don't forget now, if you see a black, after the show, a black truck race tailing out of here, it's me. I've left with your dollar. Sorry, dollar. Kind of sound like this. So instead, go on now. That's the sound that John tried to emulate. Now, we don't need to do that sound tonight because we've got a drummer. And I have to tell you something. The drum kit that he's playing on is a drum kit that W.S. Holland played on. W.S. Holland is Johnny's only drummer that he's ever had. Uh, Teresa, it's going in my left pocket. All right, I'll get it later. Oh. You'll get it later? No, I was talking about the dollar, Teresa. Anyway, what's really interesting here... What's really interesting here is that you want to, maybe after the show, come on up and talk to Steve. He'll show you the drum kit. We'll show you the snare that uh, that, uh, that WS signed, and it's really cool stuff. We have a guitar here that uh, Thomas is playing. This is a copy of Luther Perkins' guitar. It's a 55 Esquire guitar with flat wound strings. He's our Vanna White as well as our guitar picker. We've got... <laughs> We've got Dwayne Friesen playing the upright bass like uh, like Marshall Grant played. Later on in the set, we're going to do some of John's later songs. So we'll play that 51 P bass that's back here like Marshall Grant played. So we're giving you all the uh, all the authentic sounds that John put together on his record. So we're trying to deliver every single piece of that to you tonight. So if you had to close your eyes, my hope is that you hear John up here on the stage. That's really the hope, and that's the tribute. So we're going to do another one here called I Walk the Line. Here we go. Go on, clap your hands if you got some. I keep a close watch on this heart of mine. I keep my eyes wide open all the time I keep the hands out for the tide of blind Because you're mine, blow off the line I find it very, very easy to be true Myself alone each day of sleep, and I'll admit when I'm a fool for you, because you're mine. <coughs> Because you're mine, I walk the 
Does anybody out there know the biggest song, number one hit it was for many weeks? John wrote a song about a train. Do you know what train it was? It was not the Orange Blossom Special. It was a big accident down there called The Wreck of the Old 9 to 7. We're going to go ahead and do it for you now. in Tilbury. You seen John at the grocery store in Tilbury? What was he doing there? Probably buying cigarettes, wasn't he? What's that? He was on... Who am I talking to? Which one? 
I'm talking to you? Okay, because she's got to be your wife, right? She's talking for you. I know. Listen, I, I'm shutting up. That's what Dwayne Finally. said. What did you say, Dwayne, after how many years? After 30 years with the same woman, I've learned one thing. And what was it? Just shut up. <laughs> yes, dear, you're right. That's the best word you can learn. Don't listen to what he's saying. How long have you been married? A long, that's a, you know, that's the best answer, yeah. As the people said to me, Paul, when did you get married? I said, in the summer. What's that? Oh, it is safer, yeah. What's your name? Pardon me? R-O-N, Ron. Well, nice to meet you, Ron. I'm glad you're here. We're going to play some more Johnny Cash stuff for you. i like you to close your eyes and listen. It'll be just like you were at... Uh, you, did you go to one of his concerts? Oh, you just seen him at the grocery store. Were you too cheap to buy a ticket, or what was the story? I just, look, she wants to talk now. Oh, so, so he had the motorhome, so it was in the 80s. Wow. So was he going, he was going to Toronto? Oh, so you know the time frame of that? You know the time frame of that is when, uh, is when uh, um, uh, Saul Holliff, so Saul Holliff was his Canadian manager. Uh, Saul's from London, Ontario. So he was coming through, so he would have come through Windsor Way. So when he got on the Canadian border, he wasn't doing so well. In fact, they found him in that motorhome. They, they thought he was dead, and I'm not joking. Uh, no, I'm not joking. They don't know what he was drinking or what he was doing, but that was that time frame that, well, it could have been some of that too, I don't know. But uh, yeah, some of that Willie stuff. Anyway. And I'm not talking free Willie the fish. I'm talking the other Willie. I, I'm saying that that'd be the time frame that he come through Canada and he wasn't doing so well. So that's a good thing you got to see him in, in Tilbury. That's funny. Uh, who else did you meet besides John on that on that motorhome? His what? Well, he might have said it was his wife. Here's what we did. Here's what John did in 1957. A little song called "Give My Love to Rose." That's a great John story right there. I found him by a railroad track this morning. How appropriate, good song. I could see that he was nearly dead. I knelt down beside him and I listened. Words the dying fella said. They left me out of prison down at Frisco. Well, ten long years of faithful what I've done was trying to get back to Louisiana. See my rose and get to know my son. Give my love to Rose, please, won't you, Mister? Take her all my money and tell her to buy some pretty clothes. Tell my boy his daddy's so proud of him. Perfect. Don't forget to give my love to Rose. I said thanks for waiting for me Tell my boy to help his mom at home Tell my rose to try to find another But it ain't right that she should live alone Mister, here's a bag with all the money Well, it won't last them long the way it goes Bless you for finding me this morning. Don't forget to give my love to Rose. Come on, boy. Give my love to Rose, please, won't you, mister? Take her all my money, tell her buy some pretty clothes. Tell my boy his daddy's so proud 